Okay, looks like we are live. All right. Okay, so just under a minute out, welcome to the stream. Um, we're doing Advent of Code as we always do at this time of night on um, every day of Advent. Um, just a couple things before we get started. Um, go check out my website. I'm posting every day information about how I solved each problem and sort of my thinking through it. Um, so that's a good resource if you're interested. Thank, to, uh, thank you to everyone who subscribed on YouTube or followed me on Twitch or both. And thanks for liking. Um, I really appreciate it. It's, it's really cool to see as many people uh, as are viewing it. Um, so that's really great. A little bit of San Pellegrino. Here we go. Heat map. Okay, so I think that lower than any of its adjacent locations. Um, okay, so grid adjacencies for RC. Tuple is And len, so in the x direction, lines, len, lines, zero. That's the y direction. I think I did that wrong. Okay. So if it's less than, if it's, so if it's greater than or equal to, Okay.
five, four, must be the other way. Okay, we're not using that. I'll have to figure out how that's supposed to work. Because I'm lazy. Result is four. One plus its height. One plus lines R C. What? Oh, shoot. Darn it. Yes, we agree. Um, Oh, um, Yeah, I clearly don't understand this problem. So, <laughs> that's not good. Zero, 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 one, zero, two. Okay, I'm going to compute these myself. Uh, 
Oh, wait. Um, I'm counting too much. All right, this is not going well. Um, oh, there we go. Cool. Okay, finally. Oh dear. How is this not right? So wait, which one of these is two? See, that one should be a one, right? Okay, so I was right. It's, it's just... Oh dear. Okay. Okay, this is not going well. Let's read through the entire thing. Why? Okay, zero, zero. So, uh, um,
zero one zero nine two two four six. Why am I so bad at this? It's working on the example, it just doesn't work on the... Okay, um... Is it, is it, or equal to? I am still on part one, Joshua. I have no idea what I'm doing wrong. The, the example case is working, and I am I am I'm really confused. <sighs> I, I'm wary to submit this because it, it doesn't seem like it's lining up right. Because in the example, there are four, two, or four. Two, one, six, six. Yeah, probably. Oh, I'm re retarded.
Hmm. Actually, hold on. No. Okay, so let's let's just do this manually. So if, if if we're greater than or so if if we are wait if we're greater than the thing that's when it it should fail right What's the penalty if I submit now after four, five times? This is like the worst I've ever done. Um, that's a lie. I did terrible on part day 13 yes, uh, last time. Um, Dear heavens, that was atrocious. Okay. Basins. So this is flood fill around the nines. this um And then just copy that stuff.
So if x is less than 9, then Okay, clearly that's not right. Two. Hmm. Okay, so if X is less than nine, Four nine. What? This is totally wrong. Um, okay, let's let's start over. Okay.
Oh, wait a second. lines at an R and C Redefine it down here to actually do something useful. Let's see, okay.
Ooh, this is slow. Not as slow as I'm solving this. Computers are fast enough. I hope this is right. Okay, thank goodness. Okay, that was a disaster. Whew, 10 points behind. I am literally so bad at programming, guys. <laughs> yeah, I'm printing out a lot of stuff. I, I, if I remove print statements, it'll it'll help. But it was fast enough. Like it, I mean, in the amount of time that it took me to to think that I should go delete some some code. It solved it, so there's that. Um, that was so bad. What are, what did I actually get as far as rankings? Woo! 5,314. 2,937. Okay, I need to figure out what happened to my grid adjacencies function because that really, 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 really let me down. Um, and I need to clean this up. Yeah, that's not that's not how how you win this this is it. Um, Okay, let's commit this. Get my UB key here. Um All right, that was, I think, probably one of my worst days ever. Um, definitely the worst day this year. And I mean, I got 10th on, on part one on our leaderboard. Like, that's just like irrecoverable. Um, let's see, um, is Adam solving tonight? Looks like not, okay. Okay, so let's not push that, that's so bad. Let's push something nice once once we get it. Okay, so first of all, okay, which direction should we go? I guess we should start up here. And well, I guess I need to start removing some prints. That's the first thing. Um, Okay, that's pretty fast. Okay, need placement. Uh, 
Oh. Okay, even faster. <laughs> um, so the leaderboard that I am, this leaderboard is, is private, but I have my own private leaderboard. Um, here's the code, let me place it in chat. Um, yeah, th this one is a friend of mine, he, he goes to Mines and it's a Mines leaderboard, but you can join mine and you can see how you're doing. I should kick these, these guys aren't doing anything. Um, I'm still trying to figure out what happened, guys. This was like, I, I don't know how it went so badly. Well, I do, but you know, okay, so T and S are the same thing. Nice. Fun times. Let's see. Clear the cache. There we go. Yeah, that seems about right. Those days were not great for me. Um, okay, so um, I don't. I, uh, what else is there to, to do here? Um, okay, so the reason why I'm using these tuple is because you can put tuples into sets and it works because they're immutable. Um, okay, so need placement. So this is just going through all of the this just gives me all of the elements, all of the rows and column like indices. Um, let's see. So we generate a tree. F is the frontier. Um, normally this is called cur, um, and then let's just do R and C directly there. I guess just cur zero. Basically, if it's a nine, then we are, we're at a boundary, so we just stop. Um, if, yeah, so that's necessary. Okay, so if the current element is in the tree, we continue, we give up. Uh, we've already seen it. Uh, otherwise, we add it to the tree and we remove it from the needs placement because it's been placed in a tree. And then we do adjacencies. Okay, let's see if we can use, oopsies, what I do. Yep, we'll use A there. Okay, let's just see.
bounds. Okay, I, I don't understand what my bounds are doing. <laughs> So bounds, um, yeah, okay. So bounds is a tuple with low and high for each one. Oh, you know what I bet it was. Okay, let's just first do zero comma len lines. Ah, um... Let's make it default. Hmm. What is what is where does inclusive? Hmm. Oh. This grid adjacencies function doesn't work like at all. Okay, let's just let's just make it not do as many things. Um should we do it multidimensional? It's actually not that bad. Um, um, inclusive false compass. So, and then uh, the other thing is. Okay. If some 
shelter map apps onto delta is greater than one hmm Otherwise, we do the bounds check. If bounds and this should work. Um, if Inclusive, really, really, it's like, um, let's just, let's just use the bounds. Don't worry about inclusivity. Let's just always know that it's like a range. Oh, we, we do have inclusivity handled. Okay, so let's just use compass adjacencies down here and see if it works. Hmm, this is kind of confusing. Well, that's disappointing. What is going on? See, this is this is the problem. My 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 nice little helper functions didn't actually work. Well, that wasn't my only problem. It was a problem. Oh, right. Um, There we go. Okay.
Yeah, that that was not that was not good. Okay. Um Okay, down here. Let's just let's just do this. Put that there. So, like part 1 was theoretically easy. If if the row and column are less than or equal to Really, my problems are software engineering problems. Like, I didn't write docs. Like, how lame is that? Uh, whoops. Let's see. Did Adam? I'm assuming that... Who, who all beat me? Robbie. Wow, Sam didn't beat me. I'm really surprised. Jordan. Ryan. Owen. Colin, obviously. Kelly did really well. Adam did very well. Dorian did really well. Um, okay, so... There we go. 
Um, did I put in my expected for part one? Let me go double check that I actually did this right. Oh dear. Yeah, 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 okay. Okay, um, atrocious, absolute atrocity committed here. So let's add docs. Should I software my engineer my way here? Like, is this is this what I should do? Yeah, let's do it. It's gonna make me feel a little bit better about my life. Uh, redo it at race pace, but with the benefit of foresight. Oh, well, I mean, I feel like, yeah, I mean, obviously that would, that would go much, much better than this. Okay, so that's decent, I think. How do you, um, actually let's look at uh, another project that I have um, and f I'll, I'll, I'll let that next, next shell load there for a second. Um, I don't remember how you're supposed to annotate these functions.
Okay, then then when you use this, just this. Okay, this isn't quite right. Then maybe. Is it here? Parent, oh. Does this work? Does it like help me? Ooh, look at that. That's actually really cool. Okay, that's nice. The high-low tuples for each of the dimensions. And then the to use. Okay, so down here, You know, it would be really nice if I had the match new match statements. Type dot inclusive. Well, uh, let's see, exclusive. Wait, inclusive. Exclusive. Okay, do we does Grid adjacencies even do anything that we like. I guess it computes the all of the adjacencies in all directions, but we should use the bounds type thing in here. Okay, um, yeah, I'm kind of seeing how to unify this a little bit. Um, but this is the key, right?
Okay, that's decent. Okay, um, I wonder if I can actually do a Compass. Man, tonight was just Bad night. Very bad night. Okay. I'm going to forget how this works, like, you know, as soon as the next grid problem comes around next year, but I'll at least feel good about having done this. Okay, cool. Window, none of these really mattered at all. Did I use prod? Yeah, I think I used prod. Okay, let's copy all of this in to my template. This is totally unnecessary. Like way too over-engineered, but that's kind of my MO.
Let's see here. What else is there to do? Other things that we can delete. What else did I import? Enum. Okay. So We use prod. Yep, that was nice. All wait. the error. There's no error. Is that even readable? No, but who cares? Yeah, it might, it might be interesting to go through this and write it out and see see how writing it out, like if I was not incompetent and didn't screw it up this time, what I would have done. That might be something that I want to do. See, so part of the unfortunate thing about grid adjacencies is the type checking because there's no such thing as dependent types in Python. So we can't have any notion of like length of these tuples. If we had, to, if we had dependent types, that would be really, really nice here. But we'd also have to write like a language like Idris and that would be terrible. Ooh, I have an idea for grid adjacencies. What if... What if you could also, instead of this,
What if you could pass? Ugh, that sounds really, really dangerous. I was just trying to think if there's a way to, like, um, you know, make this, make the bounds computation automatic. Just passing the list. <sighs> that sounds hard. I think this is fine. Okay. Um Let's do another check here. Um, that should make it slightly faster, I think. Um, in Okay, and then tree set cur. Okay, so um, I think that the nomenclature is basin in the problem, so yeah. Basins. So that's what this does. It just flood fills. This is important because it allows us to, like, not look back at that uh, index again. And then we just add that basin in as a tuple. This is just so that it can be deduplicated. I wonder if this actually matters anymore. Yeah, because because now because of this part, we don't duplicate basins anymore. And then here, okay, this can be simplified to because basically what we want is. Um, the the top three largest
Okay, that's about it. Um, yeah, atrocious day on the leaderboard. Oh my gosh. Literal carnage. I'm really disappointed tonight. This was this was really bad. Um, I'm gonna try actually doing it from scratch. I'm gonna like rename this and then using the template. Um, sort of just for sanity's sake, just to make sure that my, because I made a lot of modifications there to my starter code. So, um, oh, that's something I should add to my starter code, I guess. I have so much Templating code, it's unreal. What is this now? 500 lines. Okay. Um. Bounds are zero, one L. Zero, and one L, one. Um, if that's if it's if that's less than R L R C Wait, what?
Huh. Good to know my test code is totally broken. What? There we go. Just a logic error. Okay. 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 I think I introduced a logic error. Shoot. Yep, there we go. Okay, so I need to go back. Seven. Okay, yeah, so this basically exposed a critical flaw in my algorithm, or in, not in my algorithm, but in my testing code.
Okay, and then here's where things kind of, I, I didn't modify these ones to use my new system. I am super disappointed. So, yeah, really bad day. I guess we'll call it there. Um, I mean, we'll be back rain or shine um, for in 22 hours and 18 minutes. So, uh, it, if you're watching on YouTube, you should come over to Twitch and watch me go down in flames again. Um, if you are on Twitch, thank you for watching. Um, and yeah. I have a I have a long way to go. I am I am a full seventeen points, is that? Yeah behind uh, second place so and then I mean first place is pretty much untouchable at this point I'm a full 38 points behind so I have my work cut out for me because third place is 10 points away and I, I, I dropped well I, I dropped 16 points to Kelly and 8 points to Ryan so that's really really bad we were because we were neck and neck as of yesterday I was only up at 2 points behind Kelly and, and like 1 point behind Ryan or something like that maybe it was flipped but yeah really disappointing um, not much else to say Uh, I guess I'll see you all in the next video.